Hello, I want to show you guys how I'm farming. Hold on. Hey, how's it going? I just want to show you how I'm personally farming Monkey Mountain. So a lot of people pointed out in the comments that this isn't the, the training. This isn't the Iron Temple that people make this out to be. And I understand why. Before... I'm pretty sure this is the exact same event that we were given way back in the day, right? The only difference from before is that we're at a level that's much stronger than what we were at. Back in the day, not many people were punching 80k. So when you're getting experience, I'm, I'm getting ones here, but that's just because I hit the, uh, I hit the limit. So I'm getting ones here. My disciple just died. He got a solid, I think he got like 10k from fighting the monsters here. The way that you should be farming these guys is literally with convert. So because you're punching 80k, it's a fixed amount. So you're getting 40k HP with Vampire Mask. You're getting straight up 40k HP each time you hit it. <laughs> oh my goodness, 14,000 gold? How am I not rich after doing this? Which... This is amazing, right? So let's see how much experience we're getting. We're getting 500, but keep in mind, my experience is cut down a 10th. So we'd be getting around 5,000, which is pretty damn good. It's, it only sucks if you're already punching more than 80K. If you're already doing that, then literally train somewhere else. But if you're if if you're a noob and you have little what's the word? What is the word that I'm thinking of? If you have a little convert gear, then literally this this is your this is your shit right now. So what I'ma do here, I'm gonna use this. Just because I know it's fixed, right? But regardless, regardless of how little my attack is, I'm gonna be punching 80k on these monsters anyways. And all I need is just a little bit of convert so i have what uh well i have 20 percent convert right here this is really good for disciples so my disciple is at 1.5 million and the cool thing is he's at 1.5 million and he's punching 80,000 on these monsters which means your boy's getting almost 80,000 damage worth of experience i wish i could i wish i had an account that didn't have the rollback charms, but was also underneath um, 40 billion. I don't have an account like, hold on. Yeah, I don't have an account like that, unfortunately, but you're, you're seeing this here. I'm getting more experience, but I'm still punching the same. And my disciple, he's getting 80K and because he's punching minimum, He's punching minimum 80k on these monsters. He's getting every single one of his health back. So this is the ultimate training experience for your disciple. I, I there's no there's no question about it. Let's see. But yeah, biggest advice is literally just get convert HP. You don't even need that much. You pretty much need at least like 5%. And 5% you can get. You can find you can find somebody selling five percent convert HP gear pretty much anywhere. Um, if you truly don't have some, I might have some, but that's yeah, I'd have to look for fucking hours. Uh, but yeah, and I died, so don't die here because the monsters still punch a good amount. They'll punch in regards to let's see how much do they hit. I think they'll hit. They're hitting a fixed amount of damage as well, so it looks like they're hitting five percent of my HP. So if I were to wear something different, or if I were to increase my HP. Yeah, so it looks like they hit about 5%. Jeez, this guy is a little too close to comfort there. But yeah, pretty much all I'm doing this event is using some of these accounts and then just attack. Uh-oh. You you shouldn't be doing that. Let me, let's just let's just use punches. <laughs> also, uh comment below what the Rick Sour Sop is for. I swear to God, I keep getting that item, and it is annoying the crap out of me. All right, so I need to cover number seven and number eight. 
Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Oh, number nine. Mighty number nine. If you know what game that's from, you are really cool. It was a terrible game, though. Let's see. So after just a little bit of training... Alright, that's pretty ass. <laughs> but the coolest part is he's not going to die here. That's the that's the main takeaway. As long as your disciple, as long as you have beans, your disciple isn't dying here because convert HP goes super hard. Let's also turn him on protect. Because the thing is, if they go off screen, they're not going to be attacking. So turning them on protect will help a lot. Also, I don't know why he's not. There it is. All right, that's good. He's attacking. I don't know why he's so slow, bro. I love how there's just this one monkey that's just killing him straight up. Let's kill him so he doesn't target my disciple. But yeah, this is the best way to train your disciple. Um, You can use auto train. You don't really have to. You can have it set so you just attack one monster. Because again, it's fixed damage on you. And you do fixed amount of damage on them. So you don't have to waste auto train. Um, I recommend buying at least a track charm. Just that way you're not watching your screen for hours. But yeah. Let's see. I'm going to bring my account from Namek. So bear with me here. Yeah, I'm going to say this. A disciple won't get these gains anywhere else. Even though it's not. I don't know. It's not huge amount this is still very uh, very better this is very very better that doesn't sound like a word this is way better than training at snails or something like that this is like beyond this is this is good this is good ass training bro monkey mountain will set you right bro bro trust in monkey mountain man i fucking like pure nostalgia has brought a lot of players back just for fucking monkey mountain <laughs> Because this was, this, this to me was literally, was, bro, this was like peak DBO, bro. Because Monkey Mountain, bro, that gave me, <laughs> that gave me my first three slot drop. I almost sold that bitch for like fucking $20 and then it got scammed off me. But, dude, this shit was so fucking cool, man. And for a lot of people, this was, this was peak DBO, bro. So I'm glad I could witness this. Not one last time. I'm sure I'm going to be here for the rest of my fucking life. Which is why we need to make DBO fucking great again, by the way. Us making DBO great again is crucial for the development of the game. Alright, so my other account has joined the fray. I'm going to prioritize training disciples. So I'm rocking the 50% um, the reduce mask and Jackie Chun. So that will help a lot. So I'm gonna see all Oh, wait, hold on. I do I ever just press use. There it is, auto train. Alright. Yep, auto train is on. Fucking love that shit, man. It's fucking fast as hell too. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna be adding accounts to this and then pretty much going hog wild. Am I right? Uh, but yeah, that's that's how I'm gonna be training my accounts for pretty much the end of the event. Like I said before, just for nostalgia reasons alone, bro. Monkey Mountain is peak EBO, and I'm glad that they added it back. What more can I say? Uh, other than Lord of Like, Lord of Subscribe, Lord of Peace. Apparently, there's like this little, um, the subscribe button will light up if you say subscribe. So that's, that's really cool.